Tolohache is a flower from Mexico. Um, it's also found in the southwest region of the United States. And um, the legend is that it's used in, uh, to make love potions. We can play it safe. So when I came to New York, I my I spoke English, but I it wasn't very fluent. Um, and of course, it's such a big city and very different from Puerto Rico. My father was a mariachi singer, and I grew up listening to him perform. He would take me with him to his shows. He would sing with a local mariachi from San Juan, uh -huh. and you know, he would travel the whole island with them but also he would perform in our family restaurant. When I got older um, I did I would perform with the group that he had every weekend performing at the restaurant and even my mom also would join sometimes and my aunt. I used to play mariachi with a male mariachi from New York uh -huh. and I was one of the only females to do mariachi in the scene in, in New York during that time. I was like, I can't believe that in such an important city there isn't a, an old female mariachi. We wanted to include our perspective and, and a lot of the female mariachis don't write their own music. Oh, we, we need to do our own music and our own point of view and, and uh, people need to listen to our thoughts and, and their expression. are comfortable kind of walking that you know we're, we exist between many worlds you know we are comfortable together because we understand that you know none of us well, few of us are born and raised American I also feel like a long time ago I, I had to learn how to just believe in in myself um, and like I said I played sports and it started there it was you know boys against girls <laughs> that kind of thing and knowing that you know, I could take, I could take on a boy, and I could beat him. The pushback in in what we do, um, and because we wear pants, and so that mentality of being like, I, I got this. You know, just because I'm a woman doesn't mean that like, I'm gonna be any less. Just us standing on stage, a lot of people are, visually are like, just like, whoa, I've never seen this before, and they're intrigued by it. And hopefully, it'll become normal to see women on stage. Oh,